All right, so do, now we've got our teams all ready to go here, and we just need F3s. Uh, since we had most of the staff just watching on the stream and stuff, um, honestly, dude, from a caster's perspective, I kind of like that. I'm looking forward to this. What are your thoughts? Oh, hell yeah, it's yeah, Siberia. Yeah, and Siberia, definitely a map where, you know, mid control, such a heavy, heavy influence on this map, but. You know, these teams are, are looking pretty crazy already, and it, it's kind of random, it's kind of shook up, but it's going to be a good, good damn match. And yeah, too, is talking about the uh, different skill levels, and right now I'm wondering, I mean, we, we've got Sparks on here, we got Higgs, Adren, dare I say Slava. Yeah, so... Slava for um, MVP. <laughs> Wonko is mute. Wonko is apparently Helen Keller. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. He's so great to go on a double date with Helen Keller and Ter Terry Shiva. I love you, dude. I love you. I don't know who Terry Shiva is. She never posed in Playboy, so I guess. Oh my god. Jahar, dude, come on. Uh, of course, if she did, it's like, you know, would she even know? She'll oh get this god. paycheck one day and be like, dude, oh, where did stop. That come from? No, no, stop. You're done. Jesus You're done. Christ. <laughs> like, I wouldn't mind if that happened to me. Like, if I got a, a paycheck from Playboy, I have no idea where it came from. Yeah, I'd be is, is Vince sort of going out? along with that? Uh, okay, I, I think we actually might have some strategy going here from the red team because, um, you know, they're, they're all in vent and uh, they said F3's in a sec. So I think they're talking things over. Hopefully, the blue team is doing a bit of the same. So, um, honestly, you know, Jahar, I, I think basically what this means is, um, you know, if this goes over well, and, and I, I think so far it has, but uh, you know, there's plenty of time for it to crash and burn. We'll see. But uh, I think basically you and I need to work on bullshitting a bit, because uh, you know, this is how it's going to be. Adrenaline is going to be playing his D role as he picks up Mega and Shotgun, looking for a bit of rocket launcher. Mm -hmm, tasty. And we're going to take a look at the red team. We already have an encroachment by two. He's pressing into that base. Sparks has picked up the med kit. Looking for armor, um, and if we go take a look at Red Moon, he has a yellow armor. And mega. Now a big I part no of this map trying to do. is that if you are the aggressive player, you're really going to be looking to make the steal for your opponent's red armor. If you can get in there, sneak in, make sure you grab their armor. First of all, you deny them that resource, and you're all stacked and ready to go for the grab there and here comes sparks making that first quad run moving his way into the blue base wonko goes down at the power of his shotgun he's only got 51 health here so let's see how far he gets oh wonko wow goes down yet flag. again and he does have the flag but or did he not grab it yeah he did grab it but he's only he's got a handful it. of health a few more seconds exactly. left with the quad oh but beautiful he's gonna rail. go down at the hands of the two with that rail nice yeah, and Wonko uh, grabs Wanko. the quad that has been dropped by his body. So that's going to shut down that first run. Slava trying to get away, but uh, will not be able to do so. I'm going uh, to watch the defenders for a second. So we, get, we just saw Higgs pick up a uh, mid kit. Wonko moving to center. Slava. Yeah, it looks like Blue's all kind of hanging out in their base. Adrenaline is playing the D. And Red has left up the Red Armor, though. Interesting. So Adrenaline, just sort of waiting for the next yeah, attack. Yeah, Adrenaline is... Yeah, he's definitely looking for it. He saw him poke out there. Saw it coming, but here he is. He's got a good stack. He's going to be grabbing this lower yellow armor once again. Getting kind of stuck here on the ice. Getting back in here just in time for the mega health. So he's got a good, strong stack, and that's what you need. Because here comes Higgs, wanting that blue flag, knocking Adren off there. And here comes Higgs. He's grabbed the flag. Wonko's there, though, and he goes down. Adren comes back through the teleporter, gets a nice rail, and takes him down. So we're still looking at a tied game at zero. Yeah, and I'm watching Sparks. Sparks was trying to steal that blue red armor. And he almost had it. He needed to survive for about uh, one and a half more seconds, and it would have been his. He's flying in here without any weapons or armor. Maybe he knows something. Like, ah, he saw that uh, perhaps the main D was over at the red armor trying to get it. Quad has been picked up. A flag has been returned, and uh, here comes that quad carrier. Good lord. 
Let's go take a look at him. It's going to be Wonko. Coming in, getting one rail. Eats one, but he will take down... Oh, now he can play D for Slava. Look at this. Great teamwork here. Slava getting a bit of help nice. from his team. Oh, my goodness. And he takes the one path that leads to... Oh boy. A potential return. Wow. Oh my god, and it's two getting this thing. Nice. Yes. That oh, was wait. a beautiful, beautiful oh Adren calls wow. bullshit. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay. Well hang on a second though. He, he called for a timeout. But but let, let's talk about that play. Um yeah, he had a little nine nine nine, I nice. guess. Something like that. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Um we're gonna get this thing resuming in about ten seconds. But let's talk about what how that happened there. Um great coverage by the uh, by the blue team Slava when when he was coming through he was really um, weak but he got a lot of help from his teammates at just the right time now look at this Sparks is gonna try to get out of here he can't pull through both of them so this is probably oh gonna be oh my god uh, really yeah, we see a handoff for Adrenaline hands more time yeah. Yeah. Than, great job than the yeah, uh, awesome, yeah. awesome job there. And Adren was <laughs> the final one there to make the grab for the flag. But he took it the extra 10 feet, and that's what was needed to make that capture. Here comes Higgs, running it yet again, but not even getting close. Right. As Adrenaline nails him down from behind with his buckshot. And Adren playing very strong D here. And the thing yeah. is, is that if you're going to play defense, you need to whore these items like nothing else. You need a strong, strong stack. Because if you're going to be useful at all, uh, you, you need to be totally impenetrable. And that's the position that Adren is definitely playing in now. But here comes two with the red flag. Stuck back here a little bit, but he does have the uh -oh. kit. Misses the jump for the for the mega health there. Going back through teleporter, wanting to uh, play the three students a bit here and get his ass out of there. But with only 19 health, beautiful. One health. Awesome amount of rails there. But Rude Mood secures his back and he takes control back of mid. Nice LG to rail combo there. And he's heading back in to refill. Yeah, and I have to I'm say, I, I've really enjoyed. Up right now. Yeah, I, I've really enjoyed how this thing is kind of going back and forth. Here comes the quad run. The quad's coming up right now. And we're gonna watch it picked up, stolen by Higgs. We had Ooh. two sitting there with it, and uh, wow, that's kind of a bit of a, oops, bit of a mistake, I would say. Just over the quad carry as he picks up another frag. Higgs coming in very, very strong now. Wow. This is the point where all of Adrenaline's resources are going to have to come into play. And Higgs, oh, takes down Wonka <laughs> one, once again. Misses the, the run for the Mega Health, but he does want to grab it. He does want to be sure that he does not head out into the mid until uh -oh, close he's range. fully stacked up here. But now Adrenaline is going to make a problem for him. Oh my goodness, yeah, look at these rails from Adrenaline. Oh wow. Look at these rails from Adrenaline. Good lord, Higgs will die. Yeah. Because no. Adrenaline is too freaking beastly with that rail gun. That was three crucial rails at the exact moment that they needed to happen in order to get that flag returned. Had they happened any other way, I think he probably could have gotten it, uh, you know, closer to the center where he might have gotten an assist from a teammate or something like that. Either way, Adrenaline yeah, really just playing some actually... amazing defense. Higgs really did have the opportunity there to take an extra second out of his day and make sure that Adrenaline goes down and not doing that really did cost him because Adrem still had plenty of weapons and he had that all-important rail and that just let him take him down. Yeah, and Higgs seems to be a very good accomplished solo runner but uh, he's doing just that, going by himself and he needs some teamwork to get out of that uh, red base alive. Excuse me, blue base. Not even letting him out of his own base. Sparks has the blue flag though, and he's making his way slowly through that ice there, up the pad. No red armor for him, but he is in the red base, and this could be a good grab. Here it is. That's going to tie it up wow. one to one. 18 second grab there. Very nice. Very nice indeed. Longo has an extremely short-lived quad run here. It's going to go to Higgs, but the red flag is going to go to two. <laughs> Walker here again grabbing the, the quad, makes his way back here and maintaining solid control over the mid, but he's going to make his way into the base, taking down Higgs, just a nice little flick shot there, but Rude, that just wasn't nice. <laughs> well, he is Rude Mood. He doesn't have yeah, to be nice. Yeah, right. <laughs>
He's got a reputation to live up 